Hi everyone, today I'll be doing a digital speed painting of my OC Myra, and I really don't know what I want to talk about. <laughs> I would talk about how to make an OC, but I don't really know how to, to teach that, like how, I don't even know. I mean, I would just say just sit down and come up with something, because that's what I usually do, so I, I really don't know how to show someone or tell someone how to do that so yeah that's, that's the thing. <laughs> and I don't even think I can like show or tell someone how to come up with a story for their OC because it's just for me I just look at the character and it's, I kind of think of a personality for them and then everything else kind of just falls into place after that so that's kind of difficult to explain <laughs> um but anyway um if you've been here for i don't know a while a year or so i don't know <laughs> i can't remember when was the last time i mentioned this but i am writing a book and um i had to kind of get myself out of the habit of saying a story even though it is a story but i mean it, i want it to be a book so i'm kind of like i don't know like making myself think this is going to be a book instead of just a story that's not going to be published because I do want this to be published. Though I haven't decided if it's going to be self-published or if I'm going to try to get a publisher. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Anyways, um, this character, um, she is... how old? I don't know. Well, the character is supposed to be like 17, but I don't know. I'm trying to remember when did I come up with this character because it's it's been a while. I want to say I came up with her in 2014 or 15, so about three or four years old. That's how old I've that's how long I've had this character, which I think is kind of cool. Um, because it's just that's just that's just really cool because there are some OCs that I didn't really like when I started drawing <laughs> seriously, like I am. Um, started taking this art thing seriously um i came up with some star wars ocs but i didn't really keep them it's kind of like after i continued drawing i kind of was just like well i don't want to draw y'all anymore get out of here <laughs> and i really haven't drawn them that much since though i did draw that first character that um kind of got me inspired to draw more um recently fairly recently um when was that I can't remember when it was, but it was um, recently when I did the um, Draw This Again thing. And um, the first Draw This Again video thing was of an old OC. So, that was a thing. But I don't really draw her anymore. So, I mean, it's like sad because it's like that's one of the first ones. But it's not sad at the same time because, I mean, you gotta move past it eventually. And that particular character, it was a character in fan fiction I was writing, which I will not talk about at all. That fan fiction has kind of become one of those things where I just look back on it and I cringe really, really hard. Can you cringe really hard? Because if you can, I'm most certainly doing it right now. <laughs> um, but, well, that fan particular fan fiction didn't, it didn't go anywhere. <laughs> But after that, I started writing a different fanfiction, and that fanfiction turned into another fanfiction, which ended up being the story that I'm writing now. Though I've changed it because it was a Star Wars fanfiction, and I've changed it so that it's not Star Wars fanfiction anymore. So, that's a thing. <laughs> um, and actually, this drawing, this was a scene that was going to be in the book, but um, I'm getting my my um, little book which was actually a gift from someone I know and I, I just it's so nice anyway <laughs> um, I was gonna have this this scene in the book but then I was like uh, yeah I don't know it, I might it might still be in there I don't know I'm still kind of I don't know oh yeah it is gonna be in there I just remember because I did just change some things around the other day so yeah this will be in there <laughs> And I kind of just drew, well, it's not, like, um, how it goes exactly, but you don't even know what I'm talking about, because you, you haven't read it yet, so, 
Um, anyway, I've been really into, um, drawn pictures with pink. It's, it's a really nice color. And I like how, um, when I go on my Instagram, um, well, not all of the pictures are on, on there are pink. Because <laughs> I just kind of recently started this, but it's like the top three pictures, like the ones at the top. <laughs> and, uh, three others that are just kind of mixed in there in the first nine. They're pink. Well, they have some pink in them, and it just it just looks really good next to you. They look really nice next to each other. And I ended up changing this at the end and making it because this character she's in her kitchen, and her kitchen is supposed to be like um, have a lot of oranges and warm colors in it. So that's what I ended up doing to make it true to what it is. But I did change it and kind of did a pink overlay, or I might have like done. Because I know I set, because I did some stuff in the background and I lowered the opacity of it and it was an orange, um, just flat orange color and um, behind it, underneath it, behind it, I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> but I just changed it from orange to pink and then it made the background look pink. And that's the one that I posted on my Instagram so that I can kind of keep with the pink theme on there because it, it's really nice. <laughs> um, yeah, that's the thing. And she's she's carrying a bowl of punch, and uh, yeah, it's just a bowl of punch. <laughs> or no, it's not punch. Yes, it, it it is punch. What am I talking about? How how can I not know my own stuff? It's it's punch. But I put some limes in there and some cherries, so it's like cherry lime limeade limeade. It's not limeade, or is it limeade or limeade? I think it's limeade. Yeah. I don't know what it is. <laughs> uh, yeah, but in the story, okay, it's it's punch. But I put, I wanted to draw the fruit floating in it. I should have put some ice in it too. But no, no, no ice. I don't like ice in drinks. I think no, that should not be done unless it's like a slushy or a frappuccino or something. That, why is the ice in there? It's just it's just gonna water your drink down. Like, come on, don't don't do that. Well, I mean, you can if you want to. Me, personally, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that. Oh, and as far as writing is concerned, sometimes, because I write everything out with my hand. I don't type it on the computer. Um, and when I'm flipping through my book, sometimes, um, like if I'm turning to the next page, sometimes I'll skip over a page or a sheet, two sheets. Is it a page? Yeah, it's a page. <laughs> I'm getting so derpy right now, but I'll skip, accidentally like skip an entire page and then I'll just be like, wow, I just did that, I just wasted some paper. Um, and I usually just put some sticky notes over it so I can write notes and I won't like get confused because I'll be like reading through it and I'll be like, wait a minute, wait a minute. oh, there are the notes, okay. <laughs> but um, I decided to like if I ever feel like drawing one of the scenes or something I can just draw it on those accidentally blank pages things so yeah that's a thing that I've started doing I've only got one drawing on the blank page so far and there's another page where I kind of just the idea wasn't working out so I stopped and it was like at the top of the page so I drew something under it yeah drew something for the particular part that I was on in the story and I'm looking at it now actually and I like it <laughs> you don't even know what I'm talking about <laughs> um anyway we're approaching the end of this I just have to draw the things in the background yeah I was gonna just leave it like that with the shinies but then I changed it and this is when I changed it to orange to make it match her, her kitchen and whenever I do backgrounds like this, it's not really fancy, and they're, they're just blobs that kind of suggest what it is, but it's like, what what is it? Like, I told my mom, though, the KitchenAid, and she was like, what? what? That's not a KitchenAid. <laughs> it's a KitchenAid. I promise you it's a KitchenAid. It's a blobber. It's a kitchen blob. That's what it is. It's not, a, it's not aiding anyone. It's just a blob. It's just a blob. <laughs> and I also like the punch bowl. I think it's really cool. Really cool. 
And I really like this drawing. And I had a lot of fun drawing it. <laughs> it was a lot of fun. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please enjoy the rest of your day.